Hello folks, Clint from Southern Style Homestead. This is a, a pokeweed. In the springtime, the southern folks takes the young tender leaves off of them when they're small. And uh, we eat it called poke salad. Really good. A lot like eating fresh spinach. But it's fall of the year. And you can see these poke berries here. Some of them are green. Some of them are purple. Still got some little immature. We got some blooms. They're in several different stages. But what we want today. Birds has done been at these. What we want today is a little purple berry. Now, Mr. Michael McGee at McGee Homestead Adventures on YouTube, he says eight, eight a day. I've done had three. They're not, they're not sweet and good like eating a blueberry. They're a little tart, a little astringent, but they're not bad. Supposed to be a surefire cure for arthritis. I went to the doctor today and got confirmation that I made up with arthritis in my spine. So we're going to do eight a day for three days and see if there's any improvement. And I will try to remember to do a video today, tomorrow, and the next day. And I'll let you know if I can feel any progress. So here we go. This is number four, number five. You don't chew them. Just put them in on your tongue, mash them against the roof of your mouth, and swallow them. The seeds can be a little toxic if you chew them. As long as you just swallow them, they will go through your system. Do not chew the seeds. All right, six, seven. Here's number eight. We're going to do an extra one. These are a little small. We're going to do nine of them. And we're going to see what happens. People that's got farms, pasture fences, if you'll notice, you have a, a real, a, a lot more of your poke berries will show up inside your fence rows. That's because the birds eat the poke berry. When they sit on the fence, they poop the poke berries out. That's why you see so many poke berry, so many poke bushes on the fences in the south. They may be a little bit toxic, but they're not poison, as the FDA would like for you to think. Y'all have a great day.